Riding more than 3,000 national hunt winners is an extraordinary achievement, but then Tony McCoy is an extraordinary man. Champion jockey 15 times in a row, and now at last, at long, long last, the first Grand National win at Aintree back in April. Let's go meet the real McCoy. For the first time. Anthony Peter McCoy is a dreamer and a winner. For more than a decade, he's been racing's outstanding performer. If you don't have the luck, then you're, you're, you're not going to survive. And luck plays more of a part in the Grand National than it does in any other race. But up until April, the biggest prize was still missing on his CV. Then, at his 15th attempt, the Lambourne based jockey finally reached his holy grail. He's going to at last win the Grand National. It's the emotion did get the, the better of me. It was just a surreal feeling, satisfaction. Um, just the enjoyment of winning what is probably the biggest, from a public perspective, the biggest horse race in the world. A royal seal of approval followed soon after, but unparalleled success demands both pain and sacrifice. I broke my ankle, I broke my left tib and fib, I've broken most of my ribs. There's a metal strip that goes down either side at the back here. I've broken my left cheekbone in three or four places. Dreams of the next target have already started. An astonishing landmark of 4,000 winners flickers on the radar, and it's the fear of failure that drives McCoy to even greater levels. I was lucky enough to be champion jockey. I've always had the fear that, that someone else would, would be champion jockey and I wouldn't be. And a lot of the times when I look back now, there was times in the last 15 years that I haven't enjoyed it as much as I, I should have done. More so purely for those reasons that, that um, that I was living in a fear of, of not being able to achieve what I wanted to achieve. In the world of a champion, winning is all that counts, whoever the opponent. No jockey has previously been named Sports Personality of the Year, even the great Lester Piggott. AP McCoy would love to create another piece of history. Lawrence Herdman, BBC South Today.